The Chosen One prophecy about a being that will bring balance to the Force and destroy the Sith is one of the most interesting and unexplored aspects of the Star Wars universe, both within the universe itself and outside of it. We've heard time and time again the Jedi's interpretations on this prophecy, with Yoda even saying that the prophecy may have been misread, and others like Qui-Gon Jinn believing full-heartedly that the being Anakin Skywalker was the fulfillment of this Chosen One prophecy, a being born purely out of the Force and fathered by the midichlorians, having no no true father in reality. The prophecy of the Chosen One states that they will ultimately destroy the Sith. Yoda himself even somewhat studied the prophecy of the Chosen One before Anakin Skywalker arrived, within the Great Holocron. It's actually within the Great Holocron that the prophecy is stated several times and different interpretations by different Jedi Masters are read. Fully defeated by just anyone, the Dark Side cannot be, but only by the Chosen One. And who might this be? A Jedi? No, I do not. But not yet born is he, or she. This much I can say. This much I can sense. A vessel of pure force the Chosen One will be, more powerful than any Jedi in history. Further within the Great Holocron, this can be found. A Jedi will come to destroy the Sith and bring balance to the Force. But what exactly are the implications of this prophecy among the Sith Order, and what do the Sith believe about this Chosen One prophecy? Many believe that the Chosen One prophecy occurred thousands of years before the Sith Order would be seemingly wiped from the star map, and after the Sith were nearly defeated by the Jedi and went into hiding, the wider Jedi Order believed that the Sith were gone forever, therefore causing many Jedi Masters to believe that the Chosen One prophecy was in fact false, and that the Sith Lords would never return again. Little did they know, in the form of Darth Bane, they were simply hiding within the shadows of the universe. Still though, the Sith themselves knew about the prophecy, so what were their interpretations of it, and this being that was said to one day destroy them? In truth, many Sith Lords thought little of the Chosen One prophecy, and still believed that no Jedi could ever compare to the power of the most mighty Sith Lords. Even more shocking than this, some Sith Lords including Darth Sidious and Darth Plagueis discarded the prophecy entirely, believing it was completely false. But still, finding humor in the fact that some Jedi would create an ultimate being that would one day destroy the Sith within their minds. The Sith themselves, though, did have a prophecy, which later Sith Lords would also grow to discard. Sith Lords like Darth Sidious, as well as Darth Plagueis. This version of a Sith Chosen One is known as the Sith Ari. The Sith Ari is described as a perfect being of the dark side of the Force, and a being that will one day destroy the Sith Order, but again, rise it from the ashes more powerful than ever. What's unique about the Sith Ari prophecy is unlike the Chosen One prophecy, it's believed that there are many Sith Aris over the Star Wars timeline. Sith Aris like the ancient Sith warrior Tulek Hord, Darth Bane, and even Darth Sidious. Darth Plagueis even for a time believed that he may be the Sith Ari. However, this was ultimately proven incorrect when he was betrayed and killed by his apprentice. One who has freed themselves from all restrictions has reached perfection, their potential fulfilled. Perfect strength, perfect power, perfect destiny. Imagine it. The prophecy of the Sith Ari was in fact so sacred that the Sith Lords refused to write it down, only passing it through the generations verbally, as they did not want any Jedi to discover their own Chosen One prophecy. Talking about the prophecy of the Chosen One with Anakin Skywalker though, this is what Darth Plagueis said about it. Prophecies are generally wishful thinking. The fact that the Sith created their own savior myth is predictable. Ultimately though, when Anakin Skywalker was revealed, Darth Plagueis was filled with fear, as he did in fact believe that this being Anakin Skywalker Skywalker would be the one to ultimately hunt Plagueis down and kill him personally. However, where Plagueis feared Anakin, Palpatine saw opportunity, and despite fearing the boy, he simply wanted him for his own, himself not truly believing that Anakin Skywalker was the Chosen One, but also growing to believe that Sidious himself was the Sith Ari, and growing under the assumption that Anakin Skywalker would still not be powerful enough to overthrow him, or at least not for a time, and when he eventually did, he would grow beyond any Sith Lord into a new dark side order. But that is what the Sith thought about the Chosen One prophecy of the being that would destroy them and bring balance to the Force, as well as some history on the Sith Lord's own prophecy of the Sith Ari, something that was fulfilled by several Sith Lords over the Star Wars timeline, not just one or two. But what are your guys' thoughts and opinions on these prophecies, the prophecy of the Jedi Chosen One, and the Chosen One of the Sith, the Sith Ari? As always, my friends, thank you guys so much for watching, may the Force be with you, and have a great day. Before you go, be sure to check out my other channel, The Marvelous Wave, where we talk all about the Marvel Cinematic Universe, including news, breakdowns, and theories about all upcoming and past Marvel movies. Link to the channel is in the description below.